Hi everyone! Welcome to Tokyo Kitchen Japanese Cooking Club. I'm Yoshimi. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make Negi Sauce no Chicken Rice. It's chicken rice served with Japanese leek sauce. Very simple, easy, budget friendly, and most importantly, delicious. At the end of the video, I will show you how I built a menu with this negi sauce no chicken rice. So stay with me till the end. Okay, let's get started. These are what you need to make four servings. Two cups of Japanese rice. Two chicken breast. Two tablespoons of Chinese soup stock or chicken stock. Some ginger. One Japanese leek. One tablespoon each of soy sauce oyster sauce, sugar, rice vinegar, and sesame oil, some salt and pepper, and if you want to make the leek sauce spicy, steamy Japanese chili mix. I'm going to prepare the rice first, so let's rinse it. Put some water, stir gently, Drain. And just repeat this three or four times. The water don't have to be perfectly clear. Let's put the rice in the pot here. It's two cups of rice, so I'm adding two cups of water. Rice and water is always one to one. Cover with the lid and let it sit at least for half an hour. By doing this, rice soak up the water to the core, so the rice is nice and fluffy to the core when it's cooked. In the meantime, let's do all the cutting. Ginger. Let's just make some slices. I'm going to use it with the skin on, so I washed it well. Japanese leek. I'm going to cook the green part with the rice, and I'm going to use the white part for the sauce. So let's cut it here, and this is for the rice. And this is for the sauce. Make some slits. And slice. Make some slits and slice. Let's put it in the bowl here. In the bowl of minced leek, vinegar, sugar, soy sauce, oyster sauce, sesame oil, and steamy Japanese chili mix if you want to make it spicy. As much as you like. Give it a good mix. I'm 
and the sauce is ready. And check in. Remove the skin. And trim all the fat. Then cut the thickness into half. Same for the other chicken. thickness into half. The rice has been soaked for half an hour, so it's time to cook. The soup stock. Some salt and pepper to taste. Give it a mix. Place the chicken evenly on top of the rice. Green part of the leek. And slice ginger. <coughs> Cover with the lid and just bring it to boil over medium high heat. Once it comes to boil, turn the heat to low, as low as it can go, and let it cook for 14 minutes. Cook for 14 minutes. Turn off the heat and let it steam at least for 10 minutes. No sneak peeking. Steaming is very important process when you're cooking rice, so don't pass it. Steam for 10 minutes and it's time to serve. Remove the leek and ginger. These are edible, but today, these are only for the flavor. Let's take the chicken out. Fluff and mix the rice. Let's cut the chicken. Slant the knife like this and cut like you're shaving it. Serve some rice on the plate. Check it.
Stack it on top. And the leek sauce. And Negi sauce no chicken rice is ready to go. Time for the tasting. Itadakimasu. The chicken is very soft and moist, and the rice soaked up all the flavor of the chicken. It's simply so good. And the leek sauce adds nice accent to the whole dish, and it's absolutely delicious. This is how standard Japanese combo style meal looks. Rice, soup, main, one or two side dishes. Negi sauce no chicken rice goes here and it also cover the main. Bean sprout miso soup or any soup you like here. Anything you like for the side dishes. But how about dashi shio potato for one of them and some sort of pickles to refresh your palate for the other one. I hope you enjoy the meal. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. More videos coming up. So don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on so that you don't miss anything. Bye.